The park is going to be packed with food trucks tomorrow for the Atlanta Street Food Festival. And just because the kitchen is uh, in a uh, food truck, it might be smaller, doesn't mean it's any less work. Last hour, we left Paul prepping for an afternoon working on the Happy Belly food truck. Now we get to see how you did. Do we have to? Yeah, really? I know. We could just oh, go gosh, right yeah. to no, commercial break no, I if you all wanted to. I am prepared to laugh. Okay, here's the thing. It's hard work, <laughs> and I thing. don't do well with that. I'm allergic to hard work, as you may know. And so this was a That's tough assignment, true. but it was really, really fun. So the Happy Belly curbside kitchen truck is one of the most popular in Atlanta, and they were kind enough to let me tag along for a trip to Cobb Galleria. Check this out. It's training day for the newest employee of Happy Belly Curbside Kitchen. As I'm cooking as the new employee, how much food am I allowed to eat? <laughs> Raquel's <laughs> laugh says it all because she knows even when it's parked, this food truck never stops moving. It's nonstop back here, right? Yeah, it's a full fledged kitchen on a truck. Oh. Today, we're heading to Cobb Galleria, just a short drive from the Happy Belly Commissary Kitchen, where the food is prepped. Set up at the Galleria is a whirlwind. Food unwrapped, menu set, ice poured. By the way, notice how hard that new guy's working? That's not how I would do it. That's not how I would do it. But she's learning. She's new. And then finally, lunchtime. We'll do as much through this as a restaurant will do. Owner Don Hall makes that happen by staffing four stations inside the truck. Cold prep, grill, fry station, and expediter. There you go. Due to the new guy's reputation concerning food consumption, I'm, I'm assuming I'm gonna get paid today. I'm just gonna get paid to eat, is what you're telling me. That's what I'm hearing. He's put out front, taking orders. So you touch NCR Silver, and it brings you into this. This iPad-based system is easy. Conquering nerves, not so much. That was the most thrilling and terrifying moment of my life. I did it. I did it. I got to keep on Soon the rookie finds his groove and basket after basket of food is served. Emily! And even though the work is tough with a team this good, Happy Belly certainly lives up to its name. <laughs> Now, basket after basket of food was served. I can't promise it was the correct <laughs> basket after basket of food. There may have been a few misorders taken. However, we did feed people, and that's all that matters. Do you have a newfound respect for what Oh, my gosh, yes, because here's the thing. I mean, again, it's very tight and cramped back there. And Happy Belly is, is unusual because, again, they prep the food in their commissary kitchen, but they are cooking on that truck. It's not like it's pre-made. I mean, they are cooking from scratch on the truck there. They have a big green egg, which gets very hot in the back of the truck. Mm. And so they are over that grill, cooking up everything to order. And they really are striving to serve, you know, the freshest and most organic food that they possibly can. But it gets to be almost a hundred degrees in the yeah. back of that truck and you're there wow. for several hours and in that Cobb Galleria location it did not stop I mean the line was there the entire time we were there sir you are no stranger to hard work I'm just gonna put that out there you are not well uh -huh. that that's a whole new level of hard work right there <laughs> all right well coming up next on good day Atlanta our pet of